This week we're bringing you stories with and about veterans and Siouxland Freedom Park. This will culminate with a half hour special Saturday night at 630 here on KTIV. Siouxland Freedom Park History and Healing. Our goal is to help raise enough funds to complete the work on the park's interpretive center. The building is there, but it's empty inside. We'll tell you how you can help in a moment. But first, a look at the Siouxland connection to the park's Vietnam Veteran Memorial, an exact half-scale replica of the wall in Washington, D.C. The names on the Vietnam Memorial are listed chronologically by date of casualty. They start in the middle and work their way outward. The very first name on the wall is that of a Siouxland native. A lot of folks in Pinder, Nebraska may not even be aware of the connection their town has to the wall. After all, it was a long time ago. Dale Bias would be almost 100 years old if he were still alive, and he has no family members in the area but he's remembered at Pender's Veterans Memorial. Army Major Dale Bias was born and raised here, but graduated high school from a military academy in Missouri. A decorated veteran of World War II and the Korean War, Bias was part of a U.S. military advisory group sent to train South Vietnamese troops in their fight against the North. He was killed by hostile fire on July 8, 1959, five years before the United States had even officially entered the Vietnam War. Bias and another U.S. soldier were watching a movie in a mess hall when Viet Cong troops ambushed them. His name is on panel 1E, line 1. Dale Bias was 37 years old. Bias is buried at Fort Rosecrans National Cemetery in San Diego, California. And we hope you'll tune in for our half-hour special, Siouxland Freedom Park History and Healing, this Saturday at 6.30 p.m. on KTIV. This is an effort, as we mentioned, to help raise funds to complete that interpretive center at the park. And you don't have to wait until Saturday to help out. Donations can be made right now. We have a link at KTIV.com. If you'd like to help, click on that link. And you can also watch all of the stories from this week.